Hello everyone and welcome back to my Let's Play of Legend of Dragoon. Last time we made our way to the Mountain of Mortal Dragon where we we found Lloyd fighting the Divine Dragon and we, we jumped in to... We finished it off pretty much, but then Lloyd stole the Divine dra Dragon Spirit. He's not a Dragoon, but he has the spirit with him. At least I'm pretty sure that's what's going on. Anyway, we are headed back to... We're headed back to Deningrad because we think Lloyd is going to go after the Moon Mirror and Miranda is very worried about Queen Teresa. So I'll see you there. Oh, stuff is happening. I just stared at the forest. I wonder where Sister Miranda and the other people are. And if they're safe. To make sure of that, we, the Sacred Knighthood, are going to act as re reinforcements. Don't worry, there is no way our sister Miranda can lose. Yes, indeed. We cannot imagine her losing. But I cannot imagine that the giant dragon will lose either. Please don't say such an ill omen thing. Uh, I'm sorry, ma'am. Sister Miranda, Dart and Company are legendary dragoons. We might not be needed. Is that Lloyd? Dragoons, they are mere humans anyway. No, that's not Lloyd. That is, um, that, that one guy whose name I can't remember. Garaha or something? Who is it? Oh, Bardell. Whoops. Humans don't need to know my name. Oh no, are you a Wingly? Yes, I am. We were the rulers of you humans in ancient Indianess. And now, I'm your executioner. Oh, they fell off the cliff. They are dead. Oh my god! This is what you asked for. This is the Great Battle of Liberation. And your scream is its overture. You conceited humans. Go to hell! Oh, Lloyd is being a good guy. Thank you. The conceited one is you. Oh, you are Mr. Lloyd! You're so easily overtaken. You blocked the magic power. Who are you? I don't need to answer you. Watch your mouth. Mr. Lloyd! D do you know him? I won't let anybody hinder the liberation of Wingleys. I'll annihilate all humans. Liberation of Wingleys? Huh. <laughs> You're so old-fashioned. A world without humans? It won't be any different from the forest you're cooped up in. I've made many sacrifices for my ideals. Your ideals cannot be achieved unless you annihilate everything. Of course! My grudge, my hatred, I'll sell them all with human lives. You should not be alive. Oh. I, I won't die alone. I was not expecting this confrontation. I don't know what to feel about Lloyd. I really don't. Like, he killed Lavitz and I'm really, really mad about that still. I will have to see where this goes. Mr. Lloyd? I wouldn't have my way. Oh, you're wounded. Please let us treat you at the castle. Okay, we know where he's going to be. We were headed there anyway, so... That works out for us. Also, did did nobody over here hear the explosions? We're only like two screens away from that. Actually, one screen, I think. So the young Bardell's definitely dead, right? And th at least two of those guards are dead because they went way off the cliff. The other one just got flung into some bushes. I don't know if he survived. I guess we'll find his corpse if he didn't. No corpse, so he's probably injured but alive. Sister Miranda. Oh, Commander of Knights. We are successful defeating the Divine Dragon and... What happened to you? You're injured? Queen Teresa. Queen Teresa was abducted. Oh, no. Wh what did you say? By who? A man called Lloyd. We're too late. 
What were you doing? Do you know where he took her? Well... <laughs> she's like raising her fist in, her fa in his face. I love that. Sister Wink might know something. My sisters are safe, aren't they? Everyone is waiting for the group to come back to the Crystal Palace. <laughs> I like Miranda. She's cool. Okay, everything here is still a wreck. I mean, that's to be expected. It's only been a few hours from their perspective, I think. Uh, Crystal Palace was this way, right? No, it's this way. Yes, there we go. Did the library survive, by the way? They had a bunch of cool junk in there. Alright, let's go see how everybody's doing. Hello. I couldn't rescue Queen Teresa. It was my fault. Queen Teresa, I'm sorry. Hey, if you're up against Lloyd, I don't blame you. He's very tough. And you're just a normal guard. No offense, but it's true. I had confidence in my swords, but I was hope helpless in front of the man. What power he has. Queen Teresa. Ah. The bandit easily defeated all the knights attacking him. He was terribly skillful. The bandit with platinum hair must not just be any guy. Yeah, he's... He's something special even among the Winglies. I don't really know anything about him, to be honest. It was a pathetic failure, and I was right in front of Tw Queen Teresa. Um, how do we go places? Here we go. None of the knights were able to even touch the bandit. Who was the guy with platinum hair? His name was Lloyd, and he's kind of a jerk. What do you mean that Queen Teresa was taken away? What has happened? Let me tell you. A few days ago, when the howling of the dragon from the Mountain of Mortal Dragon stopped. That was a few days ago? Okay. We'd assumed he'd been successfully vanished, vanquished. Everyone, everyone was happy about it. How long has it been since we've stopped hearing the howling of the Divine Dragon? It's been about one week now. Don't worry, Sister Luano said the feeling of the Divine Dragon is gone. I'm back. I have good news for you, Queen Teresa. As Sister Luano said, it seems they defeated the Divine Dragon. I'm glad. Now we can focus on the recovery of the country. I appreciate it, Wink. Please give the knights their well-earned rest. About the knights, my knighthood is currently being treated. A Wingly who had something against humans suddenly raided us. Winglies attacked you? According to Miranda, they are a friendly species. Some of the Winglies are militant. Hello. This gentleman repelled them so that we were able to come back to the castle safe and sound. Let me introduce him. His name is Mr. Lloyd, Your Majesty. It is a pleasure to meet you, Your Majesty. Not only that, it was Mr. Lloyd who gave us the good news of the successful vanquishing of the Divine Dragon. How did you find out about it? It was a coincidence. I saw Sister Miranda and her companions who completed the vanquishing in the Mount Dragon Tomb. Well, at least he's giving us credit. He's not a total dick. I understand. Let me express my gratitude to you. Actually, it was not the first time I was saved by Mr. Lloyd. Oh, I remember! This gentleman is the man of the f of the fate Sister Wink was talking about, isn't he? That's an odd sentence. The man of the fate? Queen Teresa, she was saved from the bandits of Donnell by this gentleman, too. Oh yeah, that was way back when! Like, the start of disc two? 
I barely remembered that. I only remember that because I'm editing those videos right now. <laughs> it wasn't a coincidence, was it? Helping Wink and coming here? Sister Lilana, what are you talking about? The murderous intention you conceal inside. You cannot disguise it in front of me. Wink, Seti, stay back. I feel it too. Something very wrong. I hadn't intended to make a scene. However, sometimes it can't be avoided. That is cool how he does that, though. Queen Teresa! Mr. Lloyd, what on earth? Do not come closer. What do you want? I desire the moon mirror. Moon mirror? How did you know about it? You don't need to worry about that. You should just take me there, your majesty. Answer me! From the beginning! From the beginning! It was all your purpose? Wink, get away! I just desire the power to create a utopia. Uh, it's always utopias with people. They never work out. Queen Teresa, he's reading your mind. Shall we go to the last divine moon object? Oh, well, it's easy to kidnap people when you can do that. The last divine moon object? Is he going to end this? Miranda, where's the moon mirror? In the tower of Flanville, in, in the west of Keshua Glacier. Teresa is the key to the tower. I'll take care of the rest. Sister Miranda. We'll bring Queen Teresa back. We're not going to let Lloyd get what he wants. <laughs> uh, I can't do the voices of all the sisters and the queens at once. They're all too similar. I'm not good at girl voices. Uh, I mean, I'm not good at guy voices either, but at least I feel like I have more of a range in that sense. I guess just, I should say that I don't have a very high range when it comes to higher pitches. Wide, wide range, rather. Words. How do they work? I sure don't know. Actually, how long have we been recording? Let me check something real quick. I'll be right back. Okay, this is going to be a shorter one again. Sorry about that. But, you know, that last one was super long. I think so. I haven't edited it yet, but it took me two and a half hours to record, so it's probably at least an hour long. <laughs> so, basically, Lloyd has kidnapped Queen Teresa, which sucks, but we kind of figured he was going to do that. Actually, I was worried that he was going to kill her, so this is an improvement, actually. We can still save her if we hurry. So we're headed to a tower near a glacier. That's pretty much all I know. Yep. So, thanks for watching. Hope you have a great day, and I'll see you next time. Bye!